All right, guys, this is going to be a more advanced video, and if you're not already a DeLorean subscriber, this might be a little bit more difficult to follow, but you're still going to get some knowledge out of this. But if you're a DeLorean subscriber, this video is meant for you. I'm going to teach today what I do to ensure better results off of the DeLorean software. What is going on, everybody? My name is Patrick Kenny. If you're new around here, what we do is we talk about how to make money from the internet and, of course, trade currency. And on today's video, we're going to hop on the computer screen and I'm going to show you guys exactly what I do to find the best DeLorean setups that it scans and calls via the alert panel to hopefully help you get better results with the software that I created. So, heading over here to the computer, first things first, I just pulled up a random Euro Swiss alert that was from earlier today on the 15 minute time frame. It told us at the top of this red candle to sell Euro Swiss. And uh, as you can see, it's since sold off and it's done fairly well. And from the naked eye, you might think, oh, wow, this did pretty well. This position looks good. But I want to explain to you what I look for in order to get the best results when it comes to trading with the DeLorean. And so what we have recently done is we've revamped the software. We call it 2.0, even though it doesn't look any different. We revamped the software to become a little bit more accurate and, and kind of lessen the noise, if you will, filter out the noise that comes in uh, from the DeLorean software. So you'll notice that when you go up here to training, obviously we have this watch this for the basic training guide. But when you use this four step system to ask these four questions any given call, you really only need to ask yourself these two questions nowadays with the 2.0. So it's really step three and step four you're asking. So the first thing you're gonna ask yourself really on this example, this is a sell signal, is the gray, aqua, or blue line closely above the two candles? And so if we go back to DeLorean and we notice, okay, here's the two candles right here at this price. And the question is, is the gray, aqua, or blue line closely above? Well, at the time, the closest one above was approximately right there. And this, in this example, that's about a 14 pip difference. And what we determine as closely above is 10 pips or less. And so if you ever get a DeLorean alert and you don't have one of those gray aqua blue lines within 10 pips or less above on the sell side or below on the buy side, we don't take it. And the reason being is I refer to these lines as magnets. The market loves to go back to the magnets. It loves to pull back to the magnets. And granted, I'm showing you an example that worked out fairly well. And if you had put a sell position in, you would have done okay right here. You would have gotten break even and probably gotten stopped out at even if you had been managing the position correctly based off of our rule sets with a 10 pip rolling profit rule. But with that said, you wouldn't have taken that position if you knew about this rule being that it needs to be less than 10 pips of separation. And the reason being is this has a higher likelihood of pulling back like it did, but even further pulling back up to these lines. Your best positions happen when you're near these lines and or touching these lines. And so to kind of digress to the second part of this segment here, I'm going to find EuroCAD. I kind of looked through these before uh, I showed them all to you today. I I'm going to look at this 30 minute EuroCAD position. This is another example okay, of a position where we have to find the setup. Now we find the setup here. Here's our two candles. Okay. Now notice in this segment, where are the two candles at? Well, they are right here, laying on top and just below the aqua. In this case, they have already pulled down and back into the magnets. These are acting as what we call resistant levels. And resistant levels are the best places to make those positions. So this was the ideal position that you would have taken on the DeLorean where it said to sell it here and then rolled out. Because ideally speaking, we are always trying to buy or sell near these lines. We had a lot of alerts today on like New Zealand dollar told us to buy it right here. Notice when it said to buy it here, notice where the aqua is. We're on top of it. We're back at it. We're not separated. Uh, New Zealand yen, DeLorean again told us to buy it here. Right there, we're on the aqua. And we're also right there on the gray. Again, the reason that we're doing this is so that we are not incurring unneeded pullbacks that could lead to a losing trade. And again, I know that this is probably an advanced sort of situation for a lot of you guys. And if you don't have the DeLorean, I don't expect you to understand any of this. But when the DeLorean calls a trade alert, it is just calling based off of parameters. It doesn't know where these lines are at. 
It doesn't know where the blue sits, the aqua sits, the gray sits. That's what your job is, is to look at that because that's going to base things like your actual entry, if you're going to enter or not. That's going to base things like your take profit levels and so on and so forth. And so your goal is to look and say, am I on those levels? Am I on these key levels, the aqua, the gray, the blue, whatever the case may be, so that I can actually get into that position. And so again, if you guys want DeLorean videos like these, click the like button, rack that like button up, smash it. If you don't have a YouTube account, sign up, hit subscribe, get the alerts, smash the like button, tag that thing up 100 plus likes or whatever you guys got to do. Let me know that you want DeLorean videos and I'll make you guys more advanced videos over and over and over to help you guys with this software. Because at the end of the day, yes, the live rooms are great. Yes, Shadow's great. But this software has the ability to show you how to trade and trade independently for you yourself. And my goal is so that you, I can teach you to see this market how I see it, so that when you get the alerts, you don't have to ask anybody. You know exactly if you're going to or not going to enter the trade. So hopefully this helps. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below what those questions are, and I will see you guys on the next video.